You can't visit Alex and live without tasting corn. So I got myself one. Hello, good morning, good afternoon. Muribwa Hanjirero. So I am headed to Alexander Township. This is one of the townships here in Johannesburg, South Africa. Uh, whenever I'm passing through Alex, it just reminds me of Ndilande or Bangwe Township back in Blantai, Malawi. The only difference is that houses here in South Africa, especially in our townships, they are made of iron sheets. So some people live in shacks. Unlike back home, if you don't have enough money, uh, most people build their homes using unbent bricks. For those people who have enough money, uh, they use bent bricks to build their houses. But the vibes of the townships is just the same. It's almost the same, I should say. Yeah, so when I'm passing through Alex, most of the time, or I pass there when I'm going to Kempton Park or Greenstone to visit my friends, I can just feel the vibe like this is just like home it gives me that homey homey vibe so i decided all right let me go and walk on the streets of alex and take some footages and share with my friends on youtube so let's go to alex please don't leave me alone let's go and explore alexander I'm excited. <laughs> Let's go. I just got off the taxi. I'm still at the taxi rank, as you can see here. The uh, taxi rank here in Alex is one of the best. It has three, if it's not four, um, layers, and I am at the top roof. So I'm gonna just show you around some of the angles, uh, the view of Alex taxi rank so let's enjoy the view there was a lot of music playing on the background so i had to mute all the music as you know youtube doesn't play when it comes to copyright so i don't want my video to be copyrighted so yes if you are new here welcome my name is rachel if you like this type of content, please consider subscribing. And if you like this video, give it a like, give it a thumbs up. Please leave a comment. I would like to know where you're watching me from. I'm 
Look at these chicken feet. They marinated them so well. You know what? My mouth is watering. I'm gonna grab a few and give them a test. Come and have a bite. They look yummy, yummy for my tummy. Where are you from? Malawi. Malawi. So while I was buying vegetables from the gentleman, I met a lady by the name of Pumeza. She invited me to go with her to her house, which is in section seven. So we bought a cup all the way to section seven. Unfortunately, when we get home, uh, there was no electricity. They had load shedding. The plan was, I'm going to hang out with Pumeza. We are going to buy um, quarter. Quarter is a quarter loaf of bread. Uh, they put, they add uh, chips and sausages and they add ketchup, tomato sauce. It tastes good. But unfortunately, when you get to Pumeza's house, the whole area, uh, there was no electricity. So we didn't find quarter. So we were just chilling out. She was teaching me how to bath in the room. Yeah, they use a basin when you are bathing. You bath inside the room. So yeah, enjoy watching the video.
One thing that I want to tell you is that this township is vibrant and people here are so warm, friendly, they, they are nice, accommodating. You know what? They are playing music, people are just hanging out and laughing and play together. You know what? <laughs> I feel like moving here. Can someone adopt me already? I want to live in Alex. This is uh, Alexander Suesha, the, that other side, but where I am here is Extension 7 at the bakery. Yeah, I'm enjoying Alex so far. So, yeah, let's walk around. No. <laughs> We just arrived at Pumeza's place. She's taking me to her room. She wants to show me her room. Then, yeah, I'll go ahead and show you. Okay, so I just want to show you my friend's house. Yeah, this is how it looks like. Unfortunately, there's no electricity because of load shedding. So yeah, I'm gonna show you how the whole showering or bathing situation works. This is the room and that's the big bath there. So yeah, let's do the bathing situation. So here is my bath and that's the water there. So I'm going to pour that water in this bath and continue with my bathing situation. So Pumeza is in the background. She's the one who is taking a video. So she just explained to me everything. So this is a vaslap, the one that I was holding. It's like a towel. And that's a sponge. We call it a sponge everywhere. It's a sack. It's a, like a potato sack or maybe an onion sack that she used like to scrub her face. Then that's a stone that you use to scrub yourself. I had to take out the voice because the neighbors are playing music and you know the story copyright copyright so i am going to bath we are going to pour water in the basin in the bath then <laughs> we are going to bath that water man was cold well it was cold because as i said there's no electricity so i cannot boil water in the kettle yeah but oh my goodness i don't think I can manage maybe i need to get used to the situation of having a bath in the room otherwise i'll mess the whole room with water yeah so you need to learn the techniques i didn't bath the whole body my bo whole body because i didn't want to mess pumeza's room yeah so that was it It was so fun. It was fun. We were just talking, yeah, and having a good time. She was so sweet to me. She looked after me. I know I'm going to go back to visit her. Soon, Pumeza, I'll come back. Okay, girl? Pumeza was like, Rachel, just bath. 
I was like, baby, no, baby, no. <laughs> it's not going to happen today. But hey, what an experience. It was fun. So from here, I have to take another cab and go back to the taxi rank. Take a taxi, go back home. Let's go. You cannot visit Alex and live without testing corn. So I got myself one. Here it is. I'm gonna just enjoy it. I am back at the taxi rank, but I could hear some music playing. It seems like there's entertainment happening somewhere. So let's go watch a little bit. We're going to give it like 10 minutes. Then we'll be on our way home. Can we do that? Let's go.
Please do yourself a favor. Put Alex on your travel list. Come and experience the culture, the food, and everything. As I said before, people here are friendly. People here are so accommodating. It was nice to spend a day in Alex. Thank you so much for traveling with me. Thank you for exploring with me. If you like my video, please give it a like, give it a thumbs up. If you like my content, consider subscribing. Help me to reach 2K. Can we do that? Yes, it's possible. All right, guys, leave a comment. What do you think about Alex? Is this the place that you see yourself visiting anytime soon or what? Let's have a chit chat in the comment section below. I love you for watching. Bye for now. Be kind to yourself and to others. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.